Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel, Sea Loves Fishing. Uh, today I actually got a special order in the mail. I had been waiting for these lures to arrive. Um, I first use these whenever me, uh, Mr. Keith, and Albert from Texas Bass Holes went down to Florida. Um, and we went out on the, we went out there saltwater fishing. Um, and we were using these little paddle tills from No Live Bait Needed. You can find them on Instagram. I, I will also put a little link down below. But I decided to order some because I have no doubt that these would work for bass as well. Um, and quite honestly, guys, they came in pretty quick. Like, I think I ordered them two days ago, two or three days ago. And they, they're they already here. I didn't order a lot. I just wanted to order a, bit of, a couple of them just to kind of give them a shot before I started ordering more. Um, but basically, I spent like... $23 total and that includes the $5 shipping fee from Florida to here um, But it's a it's a nice company and they make decent little lures and paddle tails and different stuff mainly saltwater, but uh, The ones I decided to order were these uh, no live bait needed obviously five inch paddle tails um, There you go guys. I will, I'll take it out of the package so you can see these um, and then this is the uh, green back three pack um, let's go ahead and just cut this open for you guys. That way you guys can see it. Uh, but these lures, guys, I mean, they're good. They're made by a little local company, and I'm sure some bass will totally smash these. So here you go. I'm going to show you guys, basically. And these are the, uh, I think these, yeah, these are the 5-inch guys. Check that out. Like, they're super thick. Um, I know Chris, the guy that runs his, uh, fishing charter down there he uses a lot of these and they absolutely smash um these saltwater fish guys but i mean they make them the three inch size i think those were the ones we were throwing for those uh spotted trout or speckled trout whatever you guys want to call them um but these right here guys these will slay tarpon down there but i have no doubt that a giant bass will destroy these here they're pretty solid nice and thick Got a nice water, uh, white bottom here, and then you got nice and green on the back. And then I ordered these uh, hooks, guys, right here. Um, that I will show you guys. These are basically, I mean, these are some pretty big hooks, guys. Quite honestly, I don't know. I don't know. I think I may have ordered them a little bit too big, but we'll still give them a shot. I mean, why not, right? Check that out. Nice big hook. We'll go ahead and hook them up here. Who knows, man? Maybe I'll start catching some. Maybe I'll land some guard and stuff like that down in the Trinity. But pretty heavy set hook for those saltwater fish. I think what I'm going to do is I'm probably going to order some 3-inch ones. And then I'm just going to order the 3-inch jig heads as well. Um, that way the hook downsizes a bit. But this hook is kind of neat, man. It's a nice stout hook there. Um, obviously, they're made for saltwater. And they also have these spiral locks here. So what you do is you'll thread the, the bait on there. And then you'll turn it on the spiral lock there. And then it actually butts it up to the to the head like this, basically. And that right there, guys, I mean, that seems like it would be a great presentation. But anyways, just wanted to show you guys that I got these um, from the No Life Bait Needed company. So if you guys are down south or somewhere along saltwater where you guys can, can access saltwater fishing... I highly recommend this company. They make some great quality stuff, which is obviously why I bought it. But anyways, um, I just wanted to kind of get on here, check how you guys are doing. I know I haven't been posting a lot of content lately. Um, there's going to be way more to come, guys. Obviously, I, I just got a new kayak, as you guys saw in the last video. Um, and then I actually made a review video on that kayak. I actually took it out fishing and stuff like that uh, this past weekend. Um, but I started to realize, you know, I was cleaning up a little bit around the house and I noticed that I have so much stuff that I don't even use and it's just sitting there collecting dust. So I figured I'd do a little quick giveaway, um, on my channel. So if you'd like to take part of this giveaway and be included, just comment down below. Um, and then I'll do another giveaway, kind of like what I did with the fish finder, except this is just lures. Um, I have three different little packs that I'm going to be giving away. But they're mainly soft plastics, guys, because I just have so many that I don't even 
like I said, I don't even use them. And all of these, I've opened some and used a couple out of them. Some of them I've never even opened. But uh, these are all local bait makers to me down here. And this this pack here is uh, by Slick Baits. That guy made some good stuff too, guys. I will slay them on these lures. Like I said, I just don't really use them. They're just sitting there collecting dust. Um, so I figured might as well give them away. Maybe a kid can win them. Um, or if you win them, you can give them to a kid that you know that loves to fish. And, I mean, they're free, right? And they work. So... This right here is a pack of worms. Uh, pretty generic, obviously. Just a little trick worm there, guys. It's got like a brown back and a white bottom with a uh, black flake in there. These work really, really well, actually. Um, and then I will also include another pack of slick baits. And this is uh, this kind of a, one of their like crawl styles. You got like a green pumpkin on the top with black flake and then a silver bottom these have amazing action on these little tentacles up here these these are great lures too um so this is one pack there um this right here is made by ardo baits uh ardo fish baits he's on instagram as well guys makes good stuff i made a video review on these a while back and they were absolutely amazing um but these are just like little two inch crawdads here guys this is a black uh, black and red flake there guys super awesome little lure soft plastic there guys um the bass totally smashed those especially coming into that winter guys i mean those black dark craw colors will definitely get them going and this is a pack of uh topwater frogs that i bought not too long ago and i literally only used one out of here but these are soft plastic so you can use a single hook or you could double hook it with the double frog hooks that you can have and it's just meant to toss out there and just kind of burn across the surface, almost a buzz bait, but it's own like, you know, soft plastic style, I guess. It would be like a ribbit toad, basically, but this is made by Power Bait, um, and it's called the Buzzin' Speed Toad. Does it make such a loud gargle um, like those top toads do, but bass will totally annihilate these, um, especially after a heavy rainfall. So that right there is going to be... Uh, one pack and then i will show you guys the second pack so this is what you'll want somebody will win these four lures here and then the next one is going to be a uh, spool of triline uh, this is monofilament here 10 pound and a color green some fish de hookers and then we'll go back into the soft plastics here this one here is going to be the same thing from slick baits guys i bought all these and i never i like i used i think i was using that pack over there i've never even used this one i just opened it to check them out this one here is more of a black worm with a brown bottom and then it has like a blue flake in there really really good trick worm here guys and they absolutely smash like these right here are insane um this next pack here is also made by slick baits um, and then this is just like a fluke style, but it's kind of cool because it has another, like it's got a weird like joinage system here, and it's got like a black, it's got blue flake, red flake, black flakes in there, and then there's their weird color. It's like a black dark back with the pumpkin bottom. Depending on how the light hits, it almost looks purple up top. Uh, but what's cool about this is I've actually, I think I used one of these actually, and uh, after it got all beat up, what I did was this whole front part was all messed up, so I just cut it literally right here, and I used this back end as a tiny little drop shot, and that was killing them too. So you could almost double it up depending on how messed up it gets, um, and it works amazing on a drop shot too. And uh, the next soft plastic that's going to go with those is going to be another one from Ardo Bates. It's the same thing. It's like a two, three inch craw here. But this one's just white. That's all it is. Um, it absolutely is a game changer, guys. These these lures here are all made by local guys um, here in the DFW area. But I figured why why let them go to waste? Um, I'm not I'm not using them. They're just collecting dust, so I might as well give these away as well. And uh, I have so many fish degrippers that I don't need these guys. These have just been sitting there. So these work really well, especially when you get down deep in their mouth. You can be able to go in there, hook them. And basically take that hook out. And then, well, this spool is just literally sitting there. So I might as well give it away. Um, and then I have one more pack. 
this pack is going to be geared more towards saltwater guys. Um, this pack here, I had bought like a mystery tackle box for saltwater fishing when I went down south uh, a couple months ago, I believe. So I will show you guys exactly what's going to come with this pack. Uh, so if you, you fish saltwater a lot, this pack here, if you want it, this is great. Um, if not, I'm sure some of these would work in fresh water and stuff like that. But the uh, first thing you're gonna, uh, I'm going to be giving away with this is going to be this metal long D hooker here, which will obviously come in handy. You know, a lot of, mainly most of the saltwater fish have teeth. Um, so you'll gill them and then you just remove the hook there. These right here, I've never used these guys. I opened it. This is Aaron's Baits, and they're basically like three inch new penny shrimp. It's what it's called. Here we could open it so you guys can see it. But, uh, like a little shrimp basically nothing crazy it's just a little little shrimp there um and then they come with these hooks here i'm, I'm guessing it's for these hooks here um and then like i said these this is geared toward salt water so it's not really gonna rust on you but those are, it's a pack of hooks and then this right here is a pompano rig never used like i said came straight out of that uh mystery tackle box and it's just sitting here, guys. I don't really saltwater fish a lot, so might as well give these away, too. This next one is a pack of saltwater assassins paddle tails. Um, check this out, guys. They're just black with the uh, chartreuse tail. You don't fish saltwater and you win this, I'm sure these will still smash some bass around your area. I mean, it's basically a paddle tail just for saltwater. Um, and these are five inches. This is another one. It is a saltwater assassin pack. Another one, literally five inches, and the color is open in the night, I believe. Um, and this is more of a purple with like a silver clear flake down at the bottom. And it's the same thing, it's just the paddle tail. Go ahead and put this one back in its pack. I'm taking them out so you guys can kind of see them. I know I'm going through pretty quickly, but it's three different giveaways that I'll be doing. This one I did use one while we we're out saltwater fishing. Um, and I ended up losing it. But this is basically called a slug, guys. This is kind of weird. Like, they're six inches, and they're just like a weird, like, long little body fish, basically. Let's see if we can open this pack. This one's kind of weird. It's like in a little plastic container. But uh, here it is, guys. It's like a little long, little stick bait. And it's got two little hard eyeballs on there um but yeah it's got some nice little joints there this right here i guarantee you would smash some bass too um but like i said it's mainly for salt water so i just figured i'd leave it all in this salt water giveaway pack here golly they're super oily i don't even know what's on there these are six inches by the way Uh, you can use them on a jig head, a drop shot, and a donkey rig, apparently. That's what the back of the pack says. Um, damn, what's on these things? I don't know what's on them, guys, but <laughs> these are super oily. But anyways, I mean, I'm sure they work. I just, like I said, Jesus Christ. Um, and then I'm also going to be throwing in this box here uh, with saltwater stuff. So this is a pretty solid pack, guys. Um, it's got a silver spoon, a treble on the end. You got a more of a uh, yellow spoon right here, a golden spoon, treble hook on there. You got a much heavier but smaller spoon there. Uh, top water popper, blue back, silver bottom, yellow cup mouth. Nice big cup to make some uh, commotion on the surface. And then you got this lure here. This one here is like a top water. Um, but it's not really like a popper. It's kind of weird how this one works, but I used it a couple times and I just put it back in the box. Um, it's also going to come with some yellow jigs with the same spiral system there. Uh, jig heads there. And then it also comes with the silver one with the red eyeballs. Same thing, just, uh, different colors. But, uh, that's pretty much it for this, uh, saltwater package here. So, like I said, there's going to be three winners and, uh... I'll announce those probably here in uh, the next four weeks or so. I'll do the drawing in about four weeks. What day is it today? Let me see. So today is uh, the 31st. It's Halloween, guys. That's awesome. So I will do the drawing November 
um, let's say November 19th, guys. So that gives it one, two, three. Let's do it the 26th. It gives you about four weeks. All right, guys. Anyways, um, basically, this is, like I said, I'll do the drawing uh, November the 26th. That way it gives you about four weeks to enter and comment down below. Um, but, yeah, basically the first... You know, the, one of the packs is going to be the saltwater pack here. This is a pretty good pack, like I said, if you, especially if you're fishing saltwater. It's actually probably the biggest bundle here, guys. Um, so this is going to be one. That's one whole pack there, guys. I'm going to go ahead and put it up over here so no, they, don't get at, they don't get in my way. And then the second pack is going to be uh, the two slick baits, uh, one of the Ardo fish baits. Another D hooker and a spool of line. Um, and then I have another pack over here, which is just straight up four soft plastic bags, a um, couple craws, and you even get a topwater buzz frog. Um, so go ahead and put those up. But, anyways, guys, uh, just kind of wanted to make a quick little video, do a little giveaway for everyone since. All of this stuff is just sitting here collecting dust. Um, by the way, I also have a 75-gallon fish tank back in here. Um, and this is holding a little pet bass. There's also a crawdad in there somewhere. He kind of likes to stay over here under this log over here. He has a little burrow there. Um, but yeah, this little guy is still looking for a name. I haven't named him, but let's get you a little bit closer so you guys can see him. Um, he's a pretty little feisty little guy. Uh, but yeah, that's kind of, there's probably like two dozen minnows in here probably like two days ago and now they're <laughs> literally like all gone. But anyways, I wanted to show you him. If you have any name suggestions, comment down below as well. Um, and then, uh, like I said, whenever I do the giveaway, I will sort everybody, everybody that's commented down below. It doesn't matter what you comment, just whatever's down below. If you've commented, even if it's just a name suggestion, whatever, um, I will include you guys in the drawing. I'm only going to let you guys input once, obviously. And then I will spin the wheel I'll probably on my laptop. And then I'll just pick random people from there that have commented below. Um, if you do happen to win, um, I'll reach out to you guys. I'll comment down below your, your name or your comment. Um, and then just reach out to me. That way we can figure out how to ship all these items to you. Um, and you don't have to worry about shipping. I'll, I'll pay the shipping as well. So... Good luck to everyone, and uh, we'll do the drawing November 26th, guys. Until next time, you guys, uh, thank you guys for, you know, supporting my channel, watching my videos and everything. So, big, big thanks to that, and uh, I just feel like these are just sitting here, so I might as well give you guys the opportunity to get something for free. And uh, until next time, guys, y'all keep on fishing.